Well, I put equal weight sugar to the unripe tomatoes. I gently mixed all the tomatoes and kind of hand smashed or squeezed really the tomatoes. I still have some of those big tomatoes to do here, or a couple. But then I put a sugar cap on top of this. This is kind of what my teacher taught me, to put a nice little sugar cap on top. It's not quite two-thirds uh, full. I was also taught to have two-thirds material, one-third airspace or headspace for the microbes to create like a microclimate in here, if you will. I'm going to do this for five to seven days, ferment it, let it sit, and then extract it as soon as it's done. It's going to be in our pantry. The pantry's been about 68 to 70 degrees. I wish it was a little warmer, but uh, this is what we're dealing with right now. I cleaned the jars with some star sands beforehand. I used this kind of sugar. The Korean Natural Farming Manual says to use brown sugar, but it's uh, it really, from what I understand, just meant to use uh, sugar that was less treated, more like raw sugar. But uh, could be wrong. Just from what I've heard other people talking about, there's some translation errors with the Korean Natural Farming book. Yep. So equal weights and then after I did all that put a sugar cap on top 